The D.C. police union is on the offensive and blaming a rise in crime in the city and a shrinking number of officers squarely on two members of the D.C. Council. The union is running a new ad that accuses Charles Allen and Chairman Phil Mendelson of ignoring public safety when passing a police reform bill two years ago. As News News4's Paul Wagner reports, now the council members are pushing back. If you're watching television in the district this week, you may notice this 30-second ad produced by the D.C. Police Union. Who's to blame for this crime wave? D.C. Council members Charles Allen and Phil Mendelson. Their laws let criminals run free and prevent police from keeping us safe. The ad goes on to blame the two men for a shrinking police force and a crime wave the union says the city hasn't experienced in 20 years. Greg Pemberton is the president of the union and explains the reason behind the ad. The fact is that the, the totality of that bill, what it does is it prevents officers from doing their job and it causes them to go look for employment elsewhere. Pemberton says the police reform bill passed in 2020 will eventually take away officers' right to due process, which he says makes it difficult to recruit and retain good cops. The D.C. Police Union says they're taking their message directly to city residents because all of their lobbying efforts here at the D.C. City Council have so far not gone their way. But D.C. City Council Chairman Phil Mendelson says changes were needed with police accountability, and that's what the law accomplished. He does not believe there's a nexus between the police reform bill, the crime wave, and a shrinking police force. Until this afternoon, he had not seen the entire ad. They don't like the fact that the law that was adopted two years ago says that they can't bargain their own discipline and make it so complicated and so untransparent that really there isn't accountability. That's what this is about, is accountability. But Greg Pemberton says the council members aren't reading the room. The changes that we've requested are very minor. Uh, they involve collective bargaining for police officers. They involve protecting due process for police officers. They the ad leaves the viewer with this. Tell Phil Mendelson and Charles Allen enough is enough. Innocent people are dying. In the district, Paul Wagner, News 4. Councilman Charles Allen released a statement this afternoon arguing the union's ad is not really about public safety but about minimizing officer accountability. He also criticized union leadership for not taking part in a hearing last week which was focused on the police department budget.